The evolution and history of land transportation, just like the evolution of humankind has gone through trials and tribulations as it has evolved through time. It has ebbed and flowed, overcoming challenges to grow to ever-increasing levels of complexity and efficiency. In this quick video, I will show you the full history of land transportation, so ensure to watch to the end of this video. Also, kindly like this video and subscribe to this channel if you are new here to help this channel grow. The evolution of land transportation all started around 3500 BC when people started to use donkeys and horses to travel and to transport things on land. Around 3500 BC, the wheel was invented. The first wheels were simply solid discs, carved from one lump of wood. The wheel changed the way that people traveled and transported things. Before the wheel was invented, the amount of things people could transport over long distances were limited. Later on, around 5,000 years ago, wagons, coaches and carriages were invented. Before people started to use wagons and carts, they would put big logs under goods they wanted to move, and roll the logs along the ground. The first kinds of wheeled vehicles were carts with two wheels and wagons having four wheels. Some few years later, man began using animals as transport. The homing pigeon is a bird that is able to find its way home from very far off. This made it possible for people to send messages to others. The message would be written on a very thin piece of paper and put into a small tube. It was then tied to the pigeon's leg. The pigeon would then be thrown in the air to fly back home to deliver the message. In the 3rd century, donkeys and mules were used for transportation. This was very important for trade across the Saharan desert. But donkeys cannot survive long without food and water, and they were replaced by camels. The ancient Greeks and Romans used them to pull carts and to carry loads. In the 20th century, they were used for military transport. In 279 BC, elephants were used for transport. Elephants are not only found in Africa. The cousin of the African elephant, the Asian or Indian elephant, is slightly smaller and easier to tame. In Asia, elephants have been tamed and used for travel and transport since ancient times. They have also been used in wars. In 1817, first bicycle was invented. In 1817, in Germany, Baron Karl von Dries made the first ever bicycle. The first bicycle was developed between 1790 and 1817. It was a bit different from today's cycles. The pedals are connected to the back wheel with a chain, and as the rider pedals, the wheels turn. The first bicycle did not have pedals. In year 1885 Gottlieb Daimler developed the motorcycle. His was not the first attempt to motorize bicycles. Earlier attempts by inventors such as Sylvester Howard Roper included experiments where steam engines were attached to bicycles. However, they did not work well, and it was only when the petrol engine was invented that motorcycles really became practical. In the beginning of the 19th century, the steam engines, trains and trams were invented. Before then, the idea of a vehicle running along a fixed track is actually much, much older. At least 2000 years ago, the Greeks and Romans had horse-drawn wagons that ran along stone tracks. The train developed out of the steam engine that James Watt developed in the 1760s. Trains were the product of the Industrial Revolution and were aided by the growth of coal mining. In year 1769, the first car was invented by French inventor, Nicolas Joseph Cugnot. His car could travel at about 4 km per hour and was called the steam wagon. It had three wheels, two in the back and one in the front. The steam boiler was in front. But in 1771, the vehicle crashed into a brick wall. As far as we know, this was the first car accident. In 1884, first electric car was made. The first electric car was made by Thomas Davenport Parker. It took Davenport 132 trials before to finally make this car. The English inventor Thomas Parker, who was responsible for innovations such as electrifying the London Underground, overhead tramways in Liverpool and Birmingham, and the smokeless fuel colite and also built the first production electric car in Wolverhampton in 1884. Later on in 1885, the first automobile running on gas was invented. In 1885, in Mannheim, Germany, Carl Benz made the first automobile that ran on gas. It was the first car that had an internal combustion. The Benz patent motor wagon is widely regarded as the world's first production automobile, that is, a vehicle designed to be propelled by an internal combustion engine. 
In 1908, Henry Ford and the Model T came in. Henry Ford, a pioneer American automaker wanted to make a car that many people in all walks of life could afford. The only way to do this was to improve the assembly line methods, which he did. He achieved his goal with his car called Model T in 1908 which he sold for $850. In 1937, Toyota Company was introduced. Toyota, the best-selling car brand in America, was first founded in Japan, by Kiichiro Toyota. The brand is said to have extremely reliable and excellent cars at a low cost. The history of Toyota started in 1933 with the company being a division of Toyota Automatic Loom Works devoted to the production of cars under the direction of the founder's son, Kiichiro Toyota. On October 1, 1964, the world first bullet train was made. The world's first high-speed rail network was known as Yumi no Chotaku, literally, the super express of dreams. The first line in Japan's now world-famous Shinkansen network, which would come to be known as the bullet train, was built against all odds, in the face of fears. The maximum speed of this train was 186 miles per hour. Finally, we have gotten to the end of this video. If you found value in this video, kindly like this video and share it with your friends. If you are new here, subscribe to this channel and turn on notifications so that you will receive our videos immediately we upload. Thanks for watching.